Hey guys, just got here from Shop Productions. So as you can see, we have a brand new uh, screen. It's so cool. I'll actually put that full screen real quick. Um, I've seen these girls before in the Bushy Road uh, tournaments, but uh, I'm not really too familiar with Love Live. But I really like that, and I like the uh, title <laughs> song. Uh, but yeah, I didn't want to get you know copyright shaked. <laughs> I don't know if uh, I could actually use that song, but hopefully I can. It's pretty catchy. Uh, so. Um, this is JC Clunch, and it's I'm coming to you live for Shadowverse live stream number 22. I forgot to mention that, <laughs> but I just want to get off the title screen real quick. So as you can see, uh, there's brand new cards for uh, Rebirth of Glory. So I thought we could check them out real quick. Let me just hop on the browser real quick. Oh yeah, now we got some Chrome action going on. All right, so um, first off. Same banner, um, you know, still Rebirth of Glory and stuff, but here are the new cards. Um, I actually haven't seen them in depth. I've seen, like, the Dragoncraft ones, because I got a little spoiled, because I wanted to take a look at them. But, um, overall, I haven't looked at the other ones, so, um, I don't know too much about, you know, too much in depth about the game, because I'm still pretty new. But, let me see, I just want to give my opinions on these cards real quick. So, we got a three... Three costs for Forest Craft, the 3-3, three, three. Uh, Tista, Wings of Mercy. So no effect on Evolve, but Evolve she gets... Give your leader the following effect. During your turn, whenever a follower is added to your hand, uh, from anywhere but your deck, give that follower plus one, plus one. This effect is not stackable and it lasts for the rest of the match. Okay. Um, That's interesting, so... Let's see, I just want to read with Roach because, let's see, if X, um, gain X, X equals the number, okay, so it doesn't, it doesn't boost, at least I don't think it boosts Roach, but this is still a cool card, you know, they add a lot of, like, fairies and stuff, so getting this, giving them a plus one, plus one, that's pretty cool, especially with Okami returning them back to hand, you can actually make them pretty big, from my opinion, um, that's pretty cool. Uh, I kind of want to tr try that out. Tista seems interesting. Uh, next up is Mager Elf. So she's a gold for Forest, and she's a one one one, <laughs> a one one one. <laughs> and uh, let's see, she actually has an invocation effect. When you played your fourth card this turn, put this card from your deck into play, then return it to your hand. So that actually works out with our new legendary. Well, with the new legend, not an hour. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't really play Forest Craft. Um, but let's see. Uh, if at least four other cards were played this turn, deal four damage to a random enemy follower. It's pretty good. I think she's a really great card. I think that cards with invocation and another effect is really good. I haven't seen too many, at least from what I know of. Most cards that I've seen just have that invocation. Um, effect. They don't usually have the other effects. So I like that she has a fanfare effect as well. So this is the first card for, that I'm actually kind of interested in, which is for Swordcraft. Um, the legendary card. So it's actually an amulet, which is interesting. Zero cost too. Uh, use X play points to put a random follower that costs X play points from your deck into play. X equals the X equals your remaining play points. Okay, at the end of your 10th turn or later, summon a steel-clad knight. Okay, this card is interesting. I mean, it really just seems like it, no joke. Just to be for uh, Liad. So, I'm not sure how I feel about that. I, I don't really like the ambush stuff. I feel it's kind of like... Uh, it's not fair, I guess. Because, <laughs> I don't know what term to use, but I don't feel like... It's definitely not fun to play against. <laughs> I'll say that. Um, it's really annoying. You can't really get rid of it. I don't, you know, by the time you can, either you're dead, or yeah, it's too big. Like I've had it. Um, I, you know, you have to waste so much resources to get rid of the Liad. But I'll see if maybe it can fit with our other stuff. I mean, it definitely does seem interesting. Like if you do draw it, you know, and you have you can't play anything. Um, you can just play it, and you get a, you know, you got a follower, for sure. So, and it, then, later on, you get this effect, the Steel Clad Knight. Let's see what a Steel Clad Knight is. 
it's just a 2-2-2, two, 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 but that's not bad, you know, just got a 2-2-2, two, two, two. um, it's pretty cool. Not bad, so let's look at the gold. Uh, the Honored Front Guard General, okay, so he's a 7 cost for 5-6, he's a ward, which is cool, uh, can't be targeted by enemy spells or and effects, so pretty much ambush, except it can't, he can still be attacked. Uh, let's see, summon a shield guardian, give it X plus X. X equals a number of times that allied followers have evolved during this match. So, this is evolution support, which is really interesting. So, a shield guardian, okay, I, I don't think I've seen this card, but he's just a 1-1-1 one, one, one ward. Okay, that's not bad. He seems interesting for sure. Um... Definitely, I'm trying to think of what I can put them in. I'm upset that there was no 11 cards. We definitely needed one more 11 card, I think. But, um, you know, he's not bad. I definitely got to see him in action. He's interesting, for sure. Um, He's not too big, but he's a ward. So, I don't know about the 7 cost. Might be a little too high. Maybe he's a little lower. Um... I gotta see, I gotta see. Um, so right now, he's like, eh, to me. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Golem Squad. I like that name, Golem. I like the picture, too. <laughs> um, alright, so. It's a spell. Three cost spell. Okay, cool. That's good for Runecraft. Um, this card has been spell boosted five times or less. So I'm gonna Clay Golem and a Scrap Golem. So that's cool. A Clay Golem is just a 2-2. Uh, so nothing crazy, but the Scrap Golem, I do remember he has Ward, so that's nice. This card has been spell boosted 6 to 11 times, summon a Guardian Golem and a Clay Golem. Okay, Guardian Golem, I don't think I've seen... Yes, actually I have seen this card. Um, Steven used it against me, and maybe a couple of other people, but yeah, I, I do remember this picture fairly well. A Ward, a 4-3-3, okay. And... Oops, who went back? And then it was, and a clay golem. Okay, so you get a bigger ward because you're trading the scrap for the guardian, which is awesome because guardian has attack and he has more defense. Yep, more defense. And you get a clay golem, so 2-2. Two, two. That's not bad. If this card has been spell boosted 12, at least 12 times, summon an ultimate clay golem and a guardian golem. So that's really crazy. I I don't think I've ever seen an ultimate clay golem, but it says this follower can evolve for zero evolution, so you got a seven seven, which is nuts. And when you evolve him, it says give your leader the following effect whenever an allied clay golem comes into play, transform it into an ultimate clay golem. So I'm liking the way Golem Squad is actually going. I like this uh, aspect of it. I haven't played Runecraft, I think, still. But I like, I really like this card, so if we do pull this, or we can actually make some of these, I definitely want to try it out. Uh, it seems really cool. Uh, oh, I almost thought this said 11. <laughs> Alright, uh, Levi Accomplished Mage. So this is the Runecraft Gold. Uh, 4-3-3. Deal X to the enemy follower. X equals two times the number of allied amulets in play. Um... That's pretty interesting from what I know, you know, the Earth, I think it's Earth Rates. Um, but they do summon, you know, there, I forgot, I think it is Earth Rates, but where they summon these cards that they can use to sack off for the effects. So that's a cool, cool effect. Oh yeah, it is Earth Rates right here. Ugh. All right, so, oh wait, Earth Sigil. So they're Sigils and Earth Rate is the what you use to sacrifice the earth sigils to do the effect okay so there it is that that's what it's used for we just have to read one more line um but yeah earth right put a random earth sigil and a random card with earth right from your deck into your hand so i feel like levi's a pretty solid gold card um definitely for the earth right deck so that's cool i don't know if it goes too well with the golem squad i'm not sure how we're gonna Build Golem Squad, like I said, I'm not too familiar with Runecraft, never really played. So, here we got a great card that I actually really like uh, as a Dragoncraft player. Um, a little high on the cost, a uh, 6, but 
And the stats are amazing. A 4 4. You know, not crazy, but that's not where she shines. She shines with her effect. And I understand why she has 4 4. So um, I'm definitely going to play Ayla Devoted Knight. She is awesome. Her art is cool too. Um, and I like, even though they just flipped the art for the evolution, I still like the little changes and stuff, like her hair is longer and stuff. So that's cool. Um, anyway, her effect, sorry, I got distracted by how, this card is crazy, in my opinion. Uh, gain an empty play orb. So just by summoning, you got an empty play orb, which is crazy. That's not it. And you could recover three play points. So she's actually not that, like, she's only a three cost, essentially. Um, which is nuts. Um, if you have the amulet, the... The Dragonic Core, oof, she will be awesome to evolve because she has this effect. If you have at least six play points, use six play points and summon a Devoted Dragon. So I really am curious to see how this interacts with the Dragonic Core. Because would we gain the play points before this effect? I really do want to see, and that will determine how crazy she really is. Um... We'll see, we'll see. But uh, her other effect is reduce damage to this follower to zero while an ally devoted dragon is in play. So that is really good for ping spells, um, especially like entrancing blow and stuff like that, since they're random. If they choose her from the randomness, that is awesome because they pretty much dealt no damage. And devoted dragon, let's see, devoted dragon. He's no pushover. He's a 6-6-6 six, 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 <laughs> uh, follower. And, you know, he he's just crazy. He gains Bane and Ward while an allied alien devoted knight is in play. So, that's nuts. Like, I think this combo, she's definitely a great of all targets. So, mm, she is great. Uh, definitely a stable, I think. I definitely want to see how she interacts with the Dragonic Core, as I mentioned before. So let's move on to the gold. Uh, the gold card for Dragoncraft is a 4-3-3. And uh, Ian's Dragon Buster's effect is uh, choose. Change this follower to an Ian and Adele newlywed or summon an enemy Adele Jealous Dragon. Interesting. Now we got to see what those cards do. Let's see an Ian and Adele newlyweds, it's a gain, it's a gain, it's a ward drain, um, okay, and the Vol return all other allied followers to your hand. That could be interesting with maybe like an Aelia to definitely like, you know, get more empty play orbs. I definitely want to see a combo with them. I can't really think of... Maybe in the Machina build, I can see some plays. Uh, oh, yeah, I can see some plays with that. Okay, maybe we could try them out in the Machina build. That'd be cool. But the other one, that we, the one we summoned to our opponent's field, it says, Last words, deal two damage to all allies. So that's cool. If we get, we give them an, uh, a creature, if they're too big for whatever reason, we can actually attack him and possibly destroy some of their creatures, which is interesting. And he's definitely in killing range for a lot of our spells. Um, so, or a lot of our effects with like Machina and stuff. So we can definitely, I, I can see him working out. Okay, definitely interesting. And he has an evolved effect, deal three damage to an enemy follower. I don't know how we would proc that off since he becomes a new card, but I don't know if we, yeah, I gotta see how, I gotta ask Steven, maybe there are ways to summon him or maybe that is an unlimited where you can play anything. You can just summon him and you have that effect, maybe, but um, I definitely, I think he's interesting. I definitely want to turn on the, this, at least the newlyweds in the Machina build see that out maybe we can get some um gadget mermaid shenanigans going on um let's see lara soul taker so shadowcraft legendary uh 444 
uh, randomly put a copy of an allied follower, excluding herself, uh, that was destroyed during this turn into your hand. Okay, change its cost to zero and give it the following effect. Destroy this follower at the end of your turn. Huh. Interesting. I can see some nutty combos with cards like Kokaitis and other cards like that. Because I remember the... I'm not sure if their keyword... They have they had something like Earthrate, but it's... I forgot the word. I forgot the term. But uh, I remember that they do summon cards from their hand and then they get destroyed. I wonder if this will proc off. If they do, Kokaitis will be crazy. Um, I'm not sure what other cards it can do. I mean, anything, I guess, right? But yeah, th this card seems nuts. Shadow, we can, we might definitely have to check her out and try Shadowcraft. Um, so let's see, their gold for Shadowcraft is Sora, Arcane Fist, uh, Necromancy. So they, you know, use four shadows to gain 2-2. Two, two. So she becomes a 4-4, four, four, which is pretty cool. Reminiscent of the Auto Blade Patroller from uh, Sword for the Machinas. Oh, let's go back there. And evolve, deal X to an enemy follower. X equals this follower's attack. So you could possibly deal five, which is pretty good. Um, next up is Bloodcraft. Their legendary seems crazy. <laughs> um, so it's an eight, six, seven. Uh, let's see. Spawn of Exile. Accelerate two, summon two voice of the abyss. Okay. They have Ambush, Strike, whenever this follower attacks, gain plus one until the end of the turn. Okay, that's interesting. And then, he himself has Ambush. If Ambush is active for this follower when it attacks, summon three. You've got three of these. Okay. Um, and then Evolved, if Ambush is active, you summon four. So you get a full field, which is pretty crazy, but... With all the stuff Bloodcraft has, I don't think this really fits right now. He probably has his own deck, I would say. I feel like it doesn't really mesh too well with the current Bloodcraft builds. So I don't know how too happy Bloodcraft players will be, but I mean, they got too much crazy stuff anyway. So uh, moving on to the gold, uh, let's see, Moriana Shadow Devil, a uh, 644. If Vengeance is active for you, recover two evolution points. Okay, this card seems pretty nuts. I don't know if it's also necessary. It'd probably be a tech. I would say they could probably just evolve more freely. But it's still a six drop for Bloodcraft. That's usually when they want to try to set up or they want to kill you. Because at seven, they have the Alpha Drive. That's the pretty much the big play, so... I mean, they're already getting a lot of evolutions. I'm not sure how this fits as well. I can see this as maybe of a tech. Um, moving on to Havencraft, Destiny Wing Knight. Okay, he's a 1-2-2. Two, two. Uh, at the end of your turn, if there are at least two allied amulets in play, gain 1-1. One, one. Okay, so he can keep buffing himself if he lives. At the start of your turn, if this follower attacks or defense has not been increased by a spell or effect, Destroy this follower. Okay, that's... Interesting. Um... Actually, with Alana, a 1... This card is really cool, because he already starts as a 2-2, two, two, and it doesn't say that increased by this card's effect. Just in general. So, Alana with this, another 2-2. Two, two. I think... Maybe it won't be necessary, but I can see him being teched in. Uh, at the end of your turn, if at least two... Okay, so he just has the same effect of all. I mean, I can definitely see him being tacked into Haven. He doesn't mesh too well. I feel like Haven already has their own deck, and it's good as is. I don't think they need this. But definitely interesting for the, the Havencraft that has a lot of amulets that they play from deck and stuff. So that's cool. Um, definitely more, I feel like, traditional Havencraft, you know? I rather than Alana, or is it Alana? I think it's Alana. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Um, it's, uh, let's see, we actually checked. She's actually on this page. Yeah, Alana, okay. I haven't played in a while, so I'm a little rusty with the names. 
All right, so we don't got too many cards left to check out. There's a lot of cool cards, I would say. Um, let's see. This one is another Haven Craft. The Lelia, Lelia, Saint of Peace, a two one four. That's interesting stats. Uh, at the end of your opponent's turn, destroy all followers. So if she lives, she's a dark hole. <laughs> That's insane. And Havencraft definitely has ways to protect them. They have a ton of wards and stuff. Interesting. I would definitely tech this as a Havencraft player, just in case maybe you get overwhelmed and stuff. But, yeah, for sure. Not necessary again. Havencraft's already fine. But, uh, let's see. Evolve game ambush until the end of your opponent's turn. Okay, so she can protect herself. If needed. If you really want to nuke. Or prevent them from playing cards. Essentially, because they're just going to lose everything. Okay. Let's see. This is a portal craft. Um, her art looks awesome. I really like her art. It's really cool. Uh, Orcus Linked Heart. So, let's see. Choose a... Choose. Summon a Lloyd, the Android, or Marionette Uno. Okay. What do they do? Uh, Ward, if this follower can be targeted by... If this follower can be targeted by enemy spells or effects, your opponent can only target this follower. Okay, so pretty much sacks himself to... Absorbs any damage, pretty much. And then Uno... Just ambush. Okay. And then whenever an allied Lloyd the android comes into play, give it plus two plus two. That's really cool. So he becomes bigger to absorb more damage. Nice. Then whenever an allied marionette Uno comes into play, summon a marionette Du. Uh, storm, which is cool. A 3-2 storm. Nice. At the start of your turn, if this follower... This follower combines with the allied Uno to become marionette tree. So they fuse. That's interesting. Um, they don't have any evolve. No, they don't have any evolve effects. Let's see tree. Also storm. Okay, can attack two times per turn. All right, summon a marionette Uno and do. That's pretty nuts. Orca's length heart is crazy. Okay, let's see evolve effect. Transform a, a puppet in your hand into a marionette trick. What? That is insane! We definitely- I definitely wanted to make Portal before, but this card to me seems crazy. We definitely gotta make Portal now. I just wanted to make it to Troll Tony, but- Oh, she has more? Oh, okay, they're just the same effects. Okay. But, that's nuts. Orcus is definitely, I think, for a- at least for a puppet Portal Craft deck, she is top notch. Really good. Uh, let's see, Veer Dole Slayer, Dole, <laughs> Doll Slayer, uh, so we got the Portal Craft, Portal Craft Gold, I can speak, um, she's a 2-1-2, two, two. Bane, which is nice, whenever an allied puppet comes into play, if you have at least two play points, use two play points to transform into Doll Slayer, okay, transform a random allied Doll Slayer into a Ver Doll Slayer, okay, Ver Doll Slayer has Ambush, Interesting. So she can kind of be permanent, and your puppets don't just go away. The problem is that you gotta use plate points, though. Interesting card. We definitely gotta try her out. I like that she's Bane. I like that this is Ambush. I feel like this is pretty good for... I'd say this is a good to decent card. I definitely gotta try him out, for sure. And then last up, we got a neutral gold card. Hamsa. How foul. <laughs> Hamsa looks crazy. <laughs> like his art, at least. <laughs> really good art. Um, at 333. If an allied follower is in play, change this follower's attack and defense to X, Y. X and Y are equal to the attack and defense of a random enemy follower. So that's nuts if, uh, like, they got Zeus or something and they didn't kill you. He can become real big and somehow you live. That's cool, I guess. But I don't... Hans is interesting, I'll say that for sure. Um, he can definitely crash into stuff. You know, like, if, uh, um, Bloodcraft has their Urius out, evolved... 
We can definitely crash into them and stuff. Um, so that's interesting. Is Hamsa the last? Neutral didn't get a new... New Legendary. Interesting. Okay. So that's it for the new cards. They seem all really good. So, definitely, definitely gotta see and try to pull them. Uh, <laughs> for sure. Alright, so let's get on. Oh, we are... Yeah, let's open packs. I actually did it right. I, I thought I skipped one. Alright, so let's go to the shop because we have a ton of stuff. Oh, hold on. We have something in our crate. What? From the Shadowverse team? Three packs? Nice. Thank you very much, Shadowverse team. And from promotion. Thank you. Five more packs. That's sweet. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta open them packs because I want to try out this try our luck maybe we get some of the brand new cards we do have a lot of crystals so we can actually get three of these right yeah we could actually spend a lot of crystals i don't mind <laughs> let's go i haven't opened the packs in like a bit i think i think last time we bought like the the bundles right bam already dude this is awesome we already just started off with atista nice Cool, cool, cool. We definitely... I did want to try her out, so... That's nice. <laughs> oh, oh, we got Mecha Claw animated. That's cool. Um, I actually do like Forest. Uh, I, I haven't... I don't think I played Forest on stream, though. But yeah, Forest is really... I think Forest is cool. <laughs> we got more Bone Blast animated. I think that's like our 10th one if we didn't liquefy any of them. We got Heartsick Demon. Unfortunately, we don't get any extra vials anymore. But, uh, you know. Hey, he's I think we liquefied all of them, so if we ever do need, I guess we got some now. Uh, I think I, we still... Do we still need a gen... I gotta check what... And I think we only need, like, archers and stuff. Animated. Um, Prison of Pain? Okay. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> Man, hold on, I forgot to put in the wants. <laughs> so yeah, this is what we're looking for. But man, Ayla Devoted Knight. Oh man, that's so good. Oh, <laughs> nice. Okay, I didn't expect that, but that's awesome. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Alright, so this is our last pack. Let's see the guaranteed. Uh, okay, Melby. That's pretty cool. Gadget Mermaid and Yo Animated Golem Squad! Yes! We got an animated golem squad? Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> These guys look nuts. Yo, Ultimate Golem is angry, my guy. <laughs> oh man, that was an awesome first. This is awesome. We got three legendaries. Man, my luck has never been this good. Alright, let's see what our second one has. I, I, I'm so excited I forgot to put up the ones, but luckily now I got them <laughs> up there. Uh, so let's go. 20 more packs with these. Uh... Hey, meet the 11 sisters. We actually haven't pulled them any. We have to make ours, so. <laughs> Too bad it's not animated. I'd love a meet the 11 sisters animated. We got pulling a lot of golds, so that's pretty good for vials. Let's go a little bit faster. We're not pulling anything. <laughs> Maybe if we don't talk about pulling anything, we'll pull something. Because that's how that's what happened in the other one. Man, that was nuts. Three legendaries. If only Steven was here, he'd be proud. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Oh, for a second I thought we got an animated gadget mermaid. Miracle of Love! Alright. <laughs> We skipped the first ones, but we got Miracle. Nice. We can actually use Miracle of Love in our um, Forest Craft deck. So. Dragon's Horde. Okay. Alright. Up to the ninth pack. Not bad, though. We, we're going to pull two Legendaries, at least. Let's see. Maybe pull another one. I don't know. And. Yo! Golem Squad! <laughs> Yo! I actually don't have Golem Squad in the wants, but after raiding Golem Squad, I definitely do want. We only need one more Golem Squad, and then 
then then it's a sign. We gotta build the deck, right? I mean, I think it's already a sign. We got an animated one. <laughs> Golem Squad. I might even animate the other ones if I really like the deck. I might use some of the Seer Orbs we got, because... I'm not sure if I showed it off. We got three Seer Orbs for free from the uh, Shadowcraft team. Shadowcraft. Shadowverse team. Um, so thank you to them. Because Seer Orbs, at least for me, are amazing. Because they're so tough for me to get as a new player. Uh, I think we use the one we get. Because we always start off with one. At least that's what Steven told me. Yo, we got a Hulk and Dragon Newt? I actually just took them off the ones. So now we actually have three, just in case. I only use two normally, but hey, the third one's not bad. Because we actually only have one real one, because the other one's temp. So. <laughs> we got an Albert? Okay. I mean, I don't need another Albert, but hey, you know, we got more Albert, right? <laughs> that's, that's another legendary, no complaints here. Uh, we're actually not getting legendaries that. We have an abundance of... I guess Albert's our first one, but... um, Hey, that's three legendaries. Dude, these pack openings were awesome! Olana! Okay, I mean, I don't play Havencraft, and I... We tra... We trashed. We, we got... We got... We liquefied our Olanas when they were giving us more. But, hey, this is the first Albert I actually pull, so we actually get the little emblem. So that's cool. Um, yeah, Those were sweet. I am not complaining. We still got a ton of packs left. So let's go. We got 43 packs to open. Oh man, so many packs right here. So let's go. Who knows? Maybe you just keep pulling broken, right? <laughs> Gotta check the chat real quick. I actually forgot. <laughs> Yo! Steven is here! <laughs> Alright, hey! Yeah, animated golem squad? Hell, double squad. Yo, <laughs> sorry. I, I had the chat hidden. Because, uh, web browser. Because I was showing off the new cards and stuff on stream before. So, um, just giving my thoughts on the new cards. But yeah, man, double golem squad. Oh, we got a new card. The, the Havencraft one. That, the Dark Hole. Okay, so... I'm not sure if I'm going to go back on the browser, so I'm going to have you hidden for a little bit, Steven. <laughs> so I might not see stuff you you say. <laughs> you see, our regular packs, I have no luck, but the ones we buy, those are top notch. I got to check if the rates are increased for those. Because... Never mind, we're always lucky. We got Golem Squad. We got we got the place. <laughs> we don't even need some. All right, we I guess we're making the deck. We're making the Golem Squad deck. <laughs> My first Runecraft deck is gonna be Golem Squad. <laughs> no complaints from me. <laughs> Golem Squad is awesome. Oh, uh, <laughs> oh man, I can't believe we pulled three <laughs> Golem Squad. Okay. <laughs> I'll just, just keep pulling Golem Squads. 11 Archer. I'm not sure if we're missing Apprentice or Archers. I need to check. Alright, one Legendary. Not terrible. I've been holding on to these pack tickets for a while, so... <laughs> they, they've been just sitting there. They've been cooking up. Alright, let's see. Maybe, maybe my patience will pay off. I was going to keep opening them like I was before, but... When I remembered they were adding cards. I already have most cards. Let's just save them up. Um, ooh, we got a Veer Dot Slayer, so that's cool, that'll help us with the Portal Craft, I really want to make that to beat Tony with it. That's my main reason I want to make Portal. <laughs> Just want to whoop Tony with his own deck, because he made Dragon Craft, and he beat me with it, so that was going to be my revenge, I'm going to beat him with Portal. <laughs> Alright, let's see, let's see. We got an animated Kel, okay, I guess that's cool, I mean... Still animated color, right? I mean, I don't want to use Havencraft, but I know we do for a certain event that I'm going to go over in a little bit, but I guess, I guess. More more, more vials, right? We can lick fire other ones. Oh, this card, I don't know if maybe you could use it in the Golem Squad deck. I know that they, you know, since they both spell, need spell boost. He's a good card. <laughs> I got beat by that card a lot of times, so... <laughs> I never understood why his cost was so high, and then once I played against it, I, I yeah, I knew why. 
<laughs> I don't know if we have, like, maybe with all the vials that we're going to get, um, we can make a lot of the stuff we're missing for room. All right, let's see. So, so far we've gotten one of the wands. We got the, the, uh, Alia. So, that's cool. She's new too, right? Yeah, she's the new one. I don't think we've pulled... Oh! Oh, <laughs> that said left. This card keeps tricking me. I keep thinking it's left. Runecraft uh, card. But she's for more for Earth Great. So. I'm not sure if you can mix both of them. We'll have to see. Alright, alright. No legendaries. Did we get legendaries in our last set of 10? I don't remember. <laughs> that Levi card keeps tricking me to think it's 11. I'm like, whoa, 11? I didn't see this. <laughs> oh, man. I, I really wish they put another 11 card, though. <laughs> I feel like we're missing one. Maybe in the next set we can get one at least one more 11. That'd be cool. Um, Because so far, Albert's... Sorry I got quiet there, guys, but I pulled so many of her. I have so many eyeshot. I think I have a playset of each art. <laughs> okay. I mean, she's pretty cool. I'm not saying she's not, but I just don't need, like, ten. <laughs> um, so we got another one of her. The Dark Bowl. So. <laughs> okay. We'll take the eyeshot, I guess, right? More vials. More vials, because I definitely know I have a playset of both arts. Which is insane. Alright, let's see. Where's my animated dragon's horde, dude? I, I'm surprised we bought so many packs and we haven't pulled an animated dragon's horde. I'm just shocked about that. Okay, I'm not. I'm not gonna say. It. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna move on. But you, you know, you, you guys know what I'm thinking. <laughs> I'm like, that's crazy. So many Aishas, dude. Uh, we got an Ian. So Ian, Ian, Ian. We'll go with Ian. Uh, so we got an Ian. So that's cool. I want to try him out in the mock build. <laughs> oh my gosh, so many Aishas. I wish we could trade. I'd be like, yeah, here, here, have all my Aishas. I have five more. <laughs> Who's this? I don't... Have I seen this guy? Wizard guy? I don't think so. Okay. Actually, let's read him. I don't think I've seen him. At the end of your turn, deal four damage to a random enemy follower. At the end of your turn, perform... Perform... <clears throat> Perform Earth Rate. Deal 4 damage to the enemy leader. Interesting. I'm surprised I haven't seen him. Maybe I, I have and I just don't remember. Ah, uh, Steven, can we trade? <laughs> I wish we could trade. <laughs> okay, cool. So, I think we need one more Ian for the Machina build. I don't know how many rupees I'm going to spend. Um, I'll probably get like... We could get like 10 more packs, I think. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Golem Squad! <laughs> okay, we got we got four Golem Squad! The playset's four, right? <laughs> we got an anime you know, art sick demon. Alright. These last three were definitely interesting. <laughs> well, the last, you know, I, I can't even talk. We got <laughs> four gold <goal> squad. <laughs> All right, we'll do ten more. We'll do ten more. <laughs> oh my gosh! Okay, we need more. <laughs> we need more. Uh, Alia, dude. We need two more. Ooh, I think that's my last hoverboard. That I needed for the animated playset. 
That's cool. Um, she's the sh oh, she's the bloodcraft. Oh yeah, she's the card I was like maybe attack, but I don't think she's really needed. I think she's just a skip for most bloodcraft. Maybe I'm wrong though, but she seems more of like a tech card. I just feel they're good without <laughs> without her. So. Vagabond frog. <laughs> Another golden squad's gonna pop up. I'm surprised two of our guarantees are golden squads. <laughs> no! Where's my anime meet the Eleven sisters? We got another Alana. Okay. I mean, she's still great. I just don't. I really don't want to play the deck. I'm not. It's not in me to play the deck. Um. Should we do? Zeman, should I do ten more? You're missing archers, I believe. Oh, sorry. I'm just seeing this. Uh, I think that was the last one you needed. I was. I wish trading was a thing too, dude. Trading would be awesome. You could train me those squads! <laughs> no, dude, I'm keeping my squad. You can have my extra one, though. Um, I think I'll leave it at that for now. Um, I did want to show you guys some stuff on the web browser, because I've been away for a while. So, oops. <laughs> Ignore the, uh, the timeline thing on the side. I forgot to change it. But, um, so there's a, as you saw from the title screen, there's a Love Live tie-in event so they have a lot of events going on and stuff um you know that they they're talking about the leaders and stuff that you can buy i don't think i'm gonna buy them i don't i'm not too familiar with love live i've seen them at the vanguard tournaments and stuff um but this is what's interesting so they have these events that where they you know you gotta win with all the crafts and stuff um so the first ones are runecraft bloodcraft and havencraft so you got to win three, no matter what, ranked, unranked, or arena. Um, so that's why I was saying I, it's not too bad that we're pulling the Alanas, because I, I definitely do want these promos. And we get to try out different crafts and stuff, because they put me out of my comfort zone, because you know, I've been sticking to the same ones as of now. So definitely, that's cool. The next one, though, that one's the one I'm excited for, the Swordcraft, Dragoncraft, and Portalcraft, because those are all the decks I want to play. Those are like... The, my decks like I really like uh, Dragoncraft and I really like Swordcraft and I definitely want to get into Portalcraft so this is an awesome week for me or two weeks almost <laughs> for me so that one's cool and then uh, Forestcraft you know that's cool Runecraft because you know Golem Squad and then uh, Shadowcraft um, I haven't played Shadowcraft too much but the promos look cool and I think they're animated because the lettering is gold so that's cool and they got these in the um What's it called? Where you where your friends and stuff? You can the chat, the guild. There you go. <laughs> so that's cool. Um, I think they should implement more guild stuff, but you know, I'm not the Shadowverse team. But just I wish we could do a little bit more in there. Um, actually get notifications when people post stuff in the guild would be awesome because Steven sometimes posts stuff and I don't even know about it. Until so he's like, hey, did you see my thing? And I was like, oh no, I didn't I didn't even know you posted a thing. So uh definitely notifications would be cool for that. Um but yeah, these are cute, so yeah. So let's go and try to go for these. So we gotta make a room craft. Wait. Oh, I was about to say, there's two room crafts? Yeah, and there are. <laughs> Alright, so let's build uh, the Golem Squad build. Um, I'll have Steven here as a backup and help me out. Um, so. I just gotta organize my desktop now that I can actually see the chat and stuff. Um, Alright, so let's make a Runecraft deck real quick. Um, Golem Squad. That's what we're gonna call it. Golem Squad. Uh, Isabel, and, alright, so we need, what do we need? We for sure need the golem squads. <laughs> um, alright, so what else does, 
Uh, spell boost. Accelerate 10. Draw a card. Put up... Okay. Cover 9 play points. Put this card into play if you have played a 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh my gosh. Okay. Huh. <laughs> Not spell boost. Interesting, though. Uh, Ginger? During your turn, whenever ally involves a trying to uncover this card. Ginger's Curse. Change the cost of a follower in your hand to 1. Okay. I mean, that doesn't really go with our deck. This one's good. Spell boost all cards in your deck 9 times. So, oh, you know what we could do? So, let's just save our deck for now. Golem. Squad. <laughs> so... <laughs> We should actually scrap some of our extra cards, because we can actually make some cards for the Runecraft deck, so... We definitely have a bunch of extras. There we go. Look at those silvers and stuff. I'll go through the other ones later. 19,000? That's insane! I don't think I've ever had that many vials. <laughs> okay, that for sure helps. Um... So now we can actually make some cards, because that card says spell boost cards nine times. That's insane. Um, so let's go back to legendaries. Um, I just want to make sure that he isn't going out of rotation anytime soon. So that he's not in brigade. Oh. It's the wrong filter. What set are you from? Uh, not Brigade. Omen? He's, yeah, he's from Omen, so we still got a bit of time. I don't mind making Omen cards. I just mind making, like, Brigade cards. Alright. Ba-bam! Alright, cool. There we go! Alright, and let's see... Hey, Steven, you got any recommendations to what cards we can actually put in here? I'm not too familiar with the uh, spell boost. So, let's see. Actually, you know, he's spell boost? No, he's earth rate. Okay. Medusa. Medusa? Isn't she bloodcraft? Huh. Summon one serpent, spell boost. Uh, summon one more. This card has been spell boosted at least seven times, summoning a Medusina. Yeah, this is a... Yeah, Bloodcraft. I didn't know there were cards that were in two things at once. And she's not from Brigade. She's not even from Omen, either. Alter Sphere? Huh. So she's interesting. Uh, let's see. Earthrite. Okay. Earthrite. Uh, Solomon, okay, to your hand, subtract X from its cost, X equals the number of times this card has been spell boosted, okay, put one of your highest costs, and play in your deck, changes, okay, I like that, that's really cool, Solomon's good, um, you can actually make a couple, a couple Solomons, there we go, Bop, bop. Uh, let's see. Reveal a random Runecraft card without spell boost from your hand, from from your deck, and put it into your hand. Gain X. Hmm. Uh, deal one damage to an enemy. Summon a witch at altar. Amulet, Earth Sigil. Okay, so this is for Earth Sigils. Tetra. I mean, Tetra is just good. Right? Whenever this follower attacks, recover one play point. How many touches we got? None. <laughs> Delta Cannon. Uh, deal two damage. Give your lead of the fall effect. She's more like... It's not terrible. I mean, spell boost, still. Right? Uh, give your lead of the fall effect. If there are at least six cards in your hand, spell boost the cards in your hand. There are five, five or less... She's really good. And we have three, so... 
Okay, deal three damage to an enemy follower if this card has been spell boosted at least six times. Then recover three play points if this card has been spell boosted at least nine times. Okay, then gain storm if this oh, this card's pretty cool too. Um, we can take a Medusa. She seems interesting. Um, I don't want to make Medusa too much. I don't need Arayo. I don't. But he says spell boost the cards nine times. Oh no. Uh, Tetra is super good. And Solomon. But I thought Fanfare was from hand. Oh, because, okay, you're saying I don't need that many Ryo. Gotcha. So you're saying I wasted some of my vials? <laughs> you don't need three. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, yeah, he puts it in your hand. Okay. Uh, Should I go down to two, then? I feel like... Mm, let's leave them at three for now. Um, I can actually look for cards at the spell boost, right? Spell boost. Should probably put boost. Uh, let's see. Oh, you know what? Low cost spells. What am I doing? Low cost spells would be good. Uh, insight. For sure. Um, I like magic missile. Magic missile is cool. Uh, conjugal. Uh, maybe. I mean, still a 2-2. Two -two. <laughs> Investigation? Grand Spire, deal 2 to an enemy far. Okay, Earthrite. Oh, Windblast. For sure. Which is Snap? Or Witch Snap? Deal 3 to an enemy follower. Put an Earth Essence in your hand. Okay. Presto Chinjo! Presto Changeo. Seems cool. Um, summon Snow. Summon one Snowman. Summon one more. That's interesting. Uh, let's see. Columns Rampage. Um, Earthrite. Are you embraced? Destroy an enemy follower, subtract. That seems good. Draw two cards. Fate's hand. That seems good too. Um. I think 17 spells is pretty good. Anything else to draw? I guess investigation, but I don't really like investigation. Um, is there any amulets that are cool? Put two insights, recover two play points. We can try it out. Let's see, we need more followers too, though. Um, okay. So he puts. Uh, he's interesting. He just gets more cards. More Mysterian cards. Uh, so I have to, a follower in your hand and put a copy in. Okay. Alright, we could look for stuff that needs spell boost. Flame Destroyer? Subtract one from its cost. Okay. Oh, we can put the Zealots, right? Try him out. He's the same thing. Yep. And we need four more. 
I'll try him out. See how he goes. Restore Z defense. Okay. Every time this. Hmm. Split randomly between the three effects. Kind of want to try that out. Anything else? <laughs> Lightning shooter. I don't know about that. Um. Do we have any spells without spell boost? Reveal a random spell that I'm putting in your hand, gain access to the okay. I don't think so. I mean, this card doesn't have spell boost. Technically, right? Hmm. See, try them out. Alright. Let's do that. Let's see, let's see. Alright, let's go into ranked. Alright. I don't know if we should. <laughs> I don't know if going to ranked is the the best idea because uh, I really haven't played Runecraft except the times I was forced to <laughs> because of like story and stuff. I actually haven't done story that much. I did record an offline video of me playing through the the first chapter of story, <laughs> but that's about it. <laughs> We're going against Dragoncraft. All right. I guess you're looking for a fight. This one's for my family. Does Runecraft like to go first or second? That's the thing I don't know about. Um, I like this. Give at the end of your turn. Yeah, this card's cool, but I think we should send it back. Magic missile. We'll keep magic missiles. See how that goes. Presto change, yo, dude. <laughs> Hopefully, we draw some followers that can get spell boosted. That would be cool. Reporting for duty. Oh, <laughs> hold on. My <laughs> my room was going off. All right, I'm back. All right, Steven said. Yeah, I need them Tetras. Tetras adds a pair mode, and on Evolve adds one cost. Adds a one cost, deal two damage to spell, so she gives. Oh, okay. Gotcha. So we can. <laughs> Got them Golem squads, dude. <laughs> Alright, so we can. I can definitely. What the heck? You didn't do anything? That stinks. Oh, wait! Magic Missile can deal. Oh! I forgot! Yo, we boosting. So if I just play this at zero spell boost? Yeah, because it says five or less, so... Should we make it into this? Nah. <laughs> we'll play draw a card. Boop boop. Yo, Solomon. Uh. Okay. Two small spells. Got it. Okay. I got you now, Steven. Now I know. Enjoy your short life. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> hmm. Um. We can get some golems, right? We can use this one instead of this one. Save that one. Because if I do Solomon, it's not going to do anything. Put one of the... Your duck. I am Solomon, the first mage. Okay. Because this card also has to be spell boosted. He didn't summon anything though. I kind of want Presto Changer, whatever he evolves. Wait, does he have an evolve effect? No. Okay. So. I got you now. Now I know what you meant by the Tetra. So I'll make Tetra. She's a good card. So. 
Oh my god. Okay. Fate's hand? Uh, drawing two cards would not be bad. I wish I could... Show me. I'm not liking that. Oh, we burned a card, oh no. Should I use the Presto Changeo? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with this. <laughs> well, next time we can summon this, which is cool. Uh, if there are at least six cards in your hand, spell boost the cards in your hand. Okay. Okay, so... You can for sure spell boost stuff every turn. So... Um, summon four serpents. She's pretty good too. Oh, I kind of want to get her up to the sub. That's the thing. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I, I probably confused this man. Like, what the heck is this? Uh, dinner turn. Only one ally followers in play. Give it plus two. Ah. Okay. So I'm guessing I propped off. Is Yo, let's blow up both his things, dude. Ah, oh, but I didn't want to summon this. Oh, we can! Lowered our cost. Okay. Bop. Hey! Ooh. Seven seven? Nice. Nice. Yo. <laughs> Next time we can summon this guy. Okay. Uh cost exploit points or less. Okay, so we can Oh Yo Golden Squad's going up there. <laughs> This Golden Squad's not- Oh, damn it. No. I think it is, I'm not sure. I- I don't think I've ever seen him. Uh, or The guy. That we destroyed. What's his name? He had a weird name. The guy who needs, uh... One of each- <laughs> You can only have one copy of each card? That's insane. Oh, cool. Okay. So, she's been spell boosted seven times, so... Hey, I can summon eight serpents? Neat. <laughs> oh, it just summons a... Oh. Instead of my small serpents, I get the big, the big serpent. Got it. The big boy. <laughs> oh, boy. And this got attacked three times, right? Uh, I'm pretty sure his effect won't proc. Yeah, no okay. And then, uh, you can summon a Z-Lot, right? Because why not? All, everything but the truth. Consider this your awakening. Since we have six cards, our cards get spell boosted. Nice. And this is at ten, so... Is that seven? Neat. Heaven's fall. Hulk and dragon. Oh boy. Be gone. Maybe we should have pressed the change of this. This is causing us trouble. No, I'm turning back to normal. Uh. Um. Huh. <laughs> what do I do about that? Because he can't be destroyed, so... Hmm... 
And I can only ping it for one. Let's see. Okay. Spell boost everything in my hand. Well, in the deck, nine times. Which is cool. Okay, Z lot. Uh, I definitely gotta get rid of this. Um. I don't want to sack everything. Th I mean, I won't even get rid of it. Only. I mean, I could. Ah, <sighs> fine. It won't be long now. I don't know if I'll have enough time, actually. And next turn we're golem squatting. Oh, we draw two cards. That's right. That card is crazy. Oh, really? Oh, neat. Thank you, Steve. I didn't know. Oh, God. These cards are so annoying. He's found a good deck. He's found a really good deck. <laughs> um, alright, so... Now we can summon our ultimate golem, right? Ultimate golem says... Uh... Oh, okay. How do we get rid of that, though? Like this! And we draw two cards for free. Oh, and that card too. Okay. So now we Golem Squad! <laughs> Boom, baby! <laughs> Yo, Golem Squad. Oh, and I can evolve for free, right? What else can I play? Can I you can play this. What if he has a big play next turn? I mean, they both have it. Sure. <laughs> oh god. Oh, we forgot to evolve him! Oh, we can. We already evolved, right. <laughs> I thought I goofed for a second. I was like, no, wait! <laughs> How do you deal with this? <laughs> I mean, does he have that card that nukes? I don't know if he got it from... Uh... When he added cards from the Kakaidas deck. Oh! Alia, nice. It won't be long now. And then Alia gets the Devoted Dragon. And he gets Ward and Bane. <laughs> nice! The Devoted Dragon got the... <laughs> it doesn't matter, I guess, right? Devoted Dragon can't be destroyed, right? Uh... Yes. So, Bob. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> I don't know if it worked out just because our opponent's deck was so weird. I've prevailed again. But I'll take it. <laughs> Yo, Golden Squad. <laughs> nice. All right, that was fun. That was fun. <laughs> Let's go again. Oh man. <laughs> what saved us for sure was that girl that you know whenever you have more than six cards spell boost something and if not draw till you have six she's broken well i don't know if she's broken but she's really good <laughs> i guess you're looking for a fight mother father come on do you want to add the tetras like steven said um Because they do seem pretty good. I don't know about having... Probably gonna send them back. 
Yo, Golem Squad. All right, cool. So, <laughs> get him anyway. Nice. I really want to get that Fate's Hand down. Fate's Hand is really good, too. <laughs> Got two Solomon. Okay. Hey, did you guys know Solomon was the first mage? Mecha Wing. All oh, right, enhanced card counts as well too. So that's a thing too. Um, let's go with the core. Show me. I'm just gonna attack these. I have a. Hmm. This hand isn't going too well. Can I rub our Solomon? Makes sense. Is eternal. Didn't play anything at three though. That's rough. I, I mean, this is rough too. I'm wasting so many play points. Um. Yeah, right. <laughs> He doesn't get rid of Solomon? I mean, I'm pretty sure he will. Smite. Oh no, our amulet! Oh, we got magic missile though. That's pretty cool. Get some spell boosts going. Uh Magic Missile. Despondent Chimera? Um Oh man. Okay. He doesn't seem too good now that I'm actually using him. You can get a scrap golem. And a clay golem. So the spell boost our other cards. Or should I wait? Um Nah, let's just use it. Show me. <laughs> should deal more damage to face? Um probably not. I don't think so. Show me. I think we're good as is. I don't want to waste my evolves. He hasn't evolved at all yet either. Got some wind blast that'll deal three. Boom blast. Wisdom is eternal. Uh, let's see. Definitely want to play this. This card is crazy good. Um, that's a Volver. Wait, there are at least six cards in your hand. Spell boost the cards in your hand. There are five or less. Oh, she spell boost the cards in my hand. That's crazy. I didn't even read that part. Okay. So. Get rid of one. Oh, hold on. Forgot to attack. <laughs> Yo, that's so good. We're gonna draw two cards for zero. This card has been so boosted too, so. Two points or less. Okay, so. I forgot what that guy's cost is. Got rid of our ward. Okay. You can deal five to something, so maybe he's probably gonna evolve and try to crash into this. What the heck? Is this a thing now? Is everyone just playing this? Reject all but thine own. It's impossible to change fate, and yet I'm confused. Yo, Golem Squad. Um. All right, so. I'm not going to waste our Wind Blast. I'm actually going to use this, because what is this again? Oh, uh, this summons the guard Guardian Golem, right. Uh, draw two for one? Heck yeah. Um, 
Wind Blast? Uh, sure. I'm gonna Wind Blast one of them. So that went down to two. Um, I'm not gonna use that Wind Blast. Oh, and he deals too? Heck yeah. Get rid of the skeletons. Why not? But I'm at nine. But I'm at nine real quick. Hey, okay, cool. Uh, Golem Squad's at three, so... So that's been spell boosted six times. So... Deal three to an enemy follower. Okay. Ooh. Warring Thunder is not terrible here, though. Oh. That's right. Forgot about that effect. Um. Hmm. Deal three. It's been 12 boosted. I kind of want to try to go for the... Let's just destroy it, right? Um, it's been spell boosted. Okay, eight times. So we don't have many plays. So let's just draw. Presto, changeo. Nice. Okay. It's been at six, and this is at nine. Nine. Okay. Cover three play points. So, he'll cost three, essentially. Oh, this card's good. Archer playing Arbiter? Whoa. Okay, so... We can, we can do some things, right? Um, spell boosted six times. Summon a guardian golem, clay golem. I kind of want to do this. Miracles are born by my hand. Okay. I didn't want that though. Uh, we can destroy it for free. Actually, if I just evolve him, consider mm. this your awakening. Maybe he has something, right? We'll save the evolve. Maybe he has something. Because if anything, we could just do the same. I was gonna say we can evolve him, put him at three, and then attack, put him at kill. But right now, maybe just leave him like that. All right, let's see. Ward, there you go. We would have been stuck. Okay. Yikes. Judge your life. You feel that too? If only you knew. Uh oh, this card has been spell boosted twelve times. So I could just do this. Deal three. Game. <laughs> I am too strong. We found the broken guys. <laughs> Golden squad. I've prevailed again. That was cool though. That early game Golden Squad is pretty cool too. It was not bad. The girl for sure that we summoned. I wish we can just. We've been getting lucky and just drawing her, but I wish there was ways to actually get her quicker. Neither is. I guess the seal of Solomon, right? You can just fetch stuff that we want. Oh, he has a leader. Nice. I guess you're looking for a fight. 
The Japanese. Oh, we got her. Nice. Um, I kind of want to send the Twin Blade back. Wind Blast. Okay, cool. We got Magic Missile and Wind Blast. Neat. Yeah, you got to use Seals when they hit 7 for the Ryo. Otherwise, you got Zealous. Okay. Thank you, Steven. Oh, nice. We got the... We got the Golem Squad. We win already. <laughs> Alright. This is cool. What are these sleeves, though? These sleeves look sick. <laughs> can I zoom... Can I see your hand real quick? Um... Magic Missile. Nice, Fate's Hand. That's not a bad draw. Um... Alright, cool, cool. I got two golem squads. Uh, okay. She only has that in hands. Still a two. Two, two. I kinda wanna get rid of it. I don't wanna take too much damage, but... I feel like we could just get rid of other stuff later. Um, let's just avoid early game damage. I bring this down too. You can use one of the golem squads, and then. Uh, Get a clay golem and a scrap golem. Does scrap golem gain attack? Yes, he does when he evolves. Okay. Oh, nothing at four? Okay. Um, magic missile. Oh, we shouldn't have done that, right? We should have actually gone for the golem squad. Like we said, we should have. Um, okay. I'm bad. <laughs> Oh, story mode sleeves, I see. No. We can actually probably do... If we go Golem Squad, we can go into Fate's Hand. Or we can do go Insight. Insight's cool, too. Um, Now we can Golem Squad. Hmm. If we save the golem squad, though, we get the guardian golem instead of our scrap golem. We're gonna have a full hand, though, if I summon... Let's just use one. Uh, then we can fate's hand. Draw two. Next time we can summon her. Um, I think that's it. I don't... Should I waste one of my evolves? Yeah, let's let's evolve this. The scrap golem, because I want actually him to do damage while he attacks. He just doesn't crash like both those. Okay. Good for nothing scrap, all of you. Okay. Um you can actually summon her too, so this is gonna I don't think we're in <laughs> more golem squads. Beep boop bop. Get rid of this. Attack <laughs> face. Alright, these are these are pretty low. So we can actually summon all of them next turn if we really want to. Golden Squad's at 9. So, it's not bad. Can he evolve for free? No, he just got stunned. Got it. 
Still pretty big damage right there. Uh, it's only been swell boosted twice. There is a Solomon. Um, I actually got rid of this right with these. Deal two. These. This is dealing three. Bop. Wind blast is two, so let's just play that because it makes the cost go down of these. I will not suffer you. Everything but the truth. Death is your fate. Death is your fate. Consider this your awakening. Can we draw a card? Okay. Um I'm probably gonna use this. Golem squad? To boost this golem squad. Okay. I, I think this is still winnable. I'm not sure what they can do at turn 8, though. Mm -hmm. Robo Goblin. Alright. Can attack twice. Ah, oh, this card's crazy. Okay, we for sure gotta try to get rid of this guy. Feel a random. Uh. I don't know if I want to use my last evolve on him, though. Well, we got her. <laughs> this ends here. Let's see you reveal. Magic is power. Magic missile. Smash him. All right, cool. Get rid of him. Shutting down. Uh. Only we can get that golem squad up. Damn. Um. If we do, if we do, we survive, right? So. Death is your fate. I'm just gonna get rid of this. Now we got ultimate golem. No. Okay. This has been spell boosted. Okay, I only need one more for her to have her effect. Ooh, it's gonna start healing. No evolves though. I feel kinda safe, but I know a lot of their cards have rush. Okay. This thing doesn't seem terrible. Like for us at least. Ultimate Golem's gonna come in clutch. Puppet Shock, okay. Air mode. Heal, okay, go to nine. <laughs> go to ten. Alright, let's do it! Bam! Medusa? Bam, bam, bam. Alright. Uh, I can still attack, I know, but I'm not going to. I don't gotta fear Amisha. No more evolves. Alright, let's see. I, I feel pretty good. I feel pretty confident. 11 life with a ward? Yes! Nice! Um... And we got the promo? Sweet! I, I forgot we already won 3. Nice! 
<laughs> yes, you have. Thank you. All right, so that was cool. Uh, Runecraft is done. Uh, we can move on to the other one. What's the next one? Uh, Bloodcraft? I don't know about Bloodcraft. Um... Oh, we completed missions. Sweet. Uh, reach level 10 with Runecraft? Win 50 ranks? Nice. Nice. And then... Oh, we got a Steel Rebellion pack? Okay. Maybe we got something. <laughs> Go back to opening packs. Um, I like the, I can see what Steven says, I need, definitely do need the Tetra, I think. There's definitely ways to improve it, the deck, but I think it ran pretty well. I, we also got to turn 10, I'm not sure how it would have done against like Haven and Bloodcraft and stuff like that. Maybe not as well because turn 10, it's a pretty long game now. Um, but I think we did pretty good with our, <laughs> with our makeshift build. Alright, so, let's see what I know from, uh, from the many times I have versed this deck. Uh, we definitely need these. Oh, that was my playset. Nice. Um, legendaries. Okay. We only have one... Mono, so that kind of stinks. Wait, doesn't Bloodcraft have a a uh, what's it called? Trial deck. That has, has that has mono in it, so right? Two mo yeah. A Techno Lord, sweet. Yo, let's just get this. We have enough crystals, so there we go. He bought the Garnet, the Funny Stack. The purchase bonus was sent to your crate. Do you want to create a duck? Yes. Rotation. Let me Oh. It just saves it? Uh, don't save. Alright, let's see. Now that we actually got the cards. Uh. Legendaries. There we go. Two mono. Um, give your leader the following effect. I mean, she's not crazy good, but she's a 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Um, your leader has taken damage during your turn at least seven times this match? Wait, what? Taking damage this turn at least seven times in this match. During my turn? Oh, that I inflict on myself? Okay, gain plus one plus one. And storm. And destroy an enemy fall. I don't think we've never... I've never seen that card being used. If Vengeance is active... Okay, she's cool. Laura. And then... I've never seen that card. Medusa's good. Uh, Calamity Bringer's good. Techno Lord's good. Uh, this card is crazy. And that's it that I can remember. On to golds. Um, let's see. Unleash the nightmare is good. Um, Azazel's good. Parts of what does he do? If vengeance is active for you, subtract one from the cost of two bloodcraft cards. Not crazy. You definitely gotta add Machina cards. So, oh, this card's good. Yeah, this card's for sure good. I don't have three though. Gotta add more Machina cards. Um, so the mono goes off. Oops. Machina. Uh, Robo Goblins. Oh, we got animated ones. So. We got animated armor bats. We do. We got two. Uh, three more cards. This card's really good, too. I think that's the deck. <laughs> Alright, that was easy. <laughs> um, We can actually scrap some cards, right? Because we got some duplicates. From the trial, I saw. 
yeah, we got more piles. Nice. I almost got enough to make another legendary, too. So. Alright, let's go back to ranked. And use this. Uh, yep. I'm not too happy about this, but we gotta use it for the promo. So. And <laughs> we gotta use Havencraft. Oh, no. Havencraft. Uh, I don't, know. I don't know if I'm happy about using that. Forest craft. Okay. Prepare for defeat. Time for me to prove myself. All right. Um, the big boys. Um, I'm thinking about keeping that metal blade. Yeah. Oh, there's a card I forgot in Trancing Blow and stuff. Damn. Okay, so we, we gotta edit the deck. I forgot about Entrancing Blow. Alright, cool. We got stuff to play next turn. <laughs> this card for sure is good, but... I don't know how... I don't know if 3 is the... What is this? Uh, select an enemy follower or can't attack next turn? Okay, so... I want to waste. The end of your turn, put a ran okay. Technology. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't want to use this, but I have to for the promo. Liza! He's just gonna roach us and we just die. <laughs> Zazel? Okay. Um, get rid of the lily. Attack for one. Um. I'll save this. She's good. I like her with the, the Metal Blade. I think that's cool. Azazel's gonna be pretty good later, too. Oh, boy. Bunch of weenies right here. Ward? This deck's so easy to use, I think. I don't even have to, like, really think. Might be misusing it, though. Um, Get rid of the Lily. Boost up our attack, my lord. Oh, another... Did we add Medusa? I think we did. I'm sorry we could summon Metal Blade. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> Another water lily. Fairy. Okay. We got to draw three cards, which is cool. Oh, there's Medusa. Uh, would not be good to summon right now, though. Oh, that's a lot of cards. Um. Machina cards in hand. Yeah. Deal two damage to a. F I mean, we got the uh, Evos. Why not? Deal two to this. The power. Attack. And then deal four. Oh boy. We already got seven. No. <laughs> We already got three destroyed. I was like, we already got seven? I don't even remember something that many. Um. Cynthia. So now the Liza can evolve for free. Okay. Now. We got too many Azazels anyway. Um, four. So there is. There's a lot of defense on the field. Uh, we can do. Do this. This. So now we got five destroyed. 
Maybe we get lucky, destroy the Cynthia without destroying the Liza. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> nice! <laughs> um, How many do we have? Five? We could search, right? That? Um, let's just summon her. I don't want to burn cards. I mean, th these two got destroyed. That's pretty much it, right? So we need to summon... She only evolves... Uh, Machinas, right? Alpha Drive? Yeah. So this is currently a Machina card. Hmm. It won't be long now. Okay. Fairies, let me your strength. That's not bad. Oh, we're terrified. Reduce the damage to zero. Okay. This is nuts, dude. Oh. Um. If you have seven cards in your hand, gain drain. Okay. Three to five are mocking the cards in your hand, gain. Rush. Six Machina cards. I don't have six Machina cards. I only have one. Um. So what does he get? Just gets the drain? I'd rather... Um. We can search. Verifying access. And then... You can actually do... Techno Lord destroys everything. So... Oh, right. Doesn't destroy that. Then we have six? Okay, so... We're pretty much there. <laughs> Just destroy one more. And if I... Um, this is... Alpha Drive's a 5 cost? Okay. So, we're pretty much there. You and I have some fun. Gonna destroy two of them. This ends here. Oh boy. Also, Searing Demon and whatever her name is, the one with war that gives you strength. Shutting down. Okay, yeah. I can add her. Oh no. Can't attack. Um We can do repair mode. We got the seven, right? Yes. So why don't we do Medusa? Next time we could do Mecha Wing into the Mono, so. Let us Looks like it's fading time. Scared yet? Oh, my feet. Uh, booster? Nah. Boost ourselves. Yeah, there's definitely cards that I forgot to add. Forest Defender. <sighs> Broken? <laughs> Guy's good. I'd rather not, but you seem rather fond of violence. Impressive technology. Sorry. <laughs> And these are just... Oh my gosh, this deck is nuts, dude. I didn't even build it right, and it's still nuts. Oh man, this isn't even fun, man. This is just, like, destruction. Just by summoning these, I win. Which is nuts. 
Oh man, he kills me right here, right? Okami. Nah, he's just gonna deal four. Which sucks, dude. I'm really sorry. Like, I feel so bad just playing this. Bop. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Clicked the wrong one. Go mad for me, darling. <laughs> You're strong. Okay. That was dumb. The big dumb. All too easy. <laughs> Alright, let's edit the duck. <sighs> Um, I guess let's just trash this, right? Because we didn't build it right? <laughs> uh, we need... We need Machina cards, so... Boop, boop, boop. Here we are. Hey, mono. Gear Lady. Bat. Did we have that? I don't remember. Teeman. Mecha Wing. This guy. Techno Lord. And then. Go back to the beginning. Let's see what I forgot. Steven said I forgot the Ward Girl, which is true. The Hellblaze. She's really good. Um. This card, <laughs> I want to use this card because the owl cat. Oh, uh, she do. Vengeance is active for you. All oh, right, this this card's not bad. Blood pact, eh. trancing blow, and then unleash nightmare. Broken card. You said Searing Demon? Searing... I don't know how you spell it. I, I feel like if I put Demon, a bunch of cards are gonna come up. Uh... I don't see that card, Steven. Searing Demon? I'll keep looking, but I don't know which one you are referring to. Uh, let's see. What is this? Get two damage to your lead or recover one evolution point. Oh, Azazel. Did we put Azazel? We did not put Azazel. Alright. I didn't want to add it. Uh, we gotta get rid of two cards. Um, what cards? I guess one of her. Maybe not. Um, I guess one of her, right? One mono. No mono. You don't want to get rid of. I feel like you want to keep them. One of him. And then... One of this, probably. Oh, Hellblaze? Hellblaze? Oh, okay. Gotcha. Uh, we also... I feel like this... The vampire girl we got is really good. Maybe one less Techno Lord? Is Techno Lord even needed? <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I don't think Techno Lord is needed. Maybe you could just bump up Metal Blade Demon again just to get more draw. Just make it more consistent. 
I'm not gonna name it. It's just... <laughs> you know what? I will name it. The Big Dumb. <laughs> it's crazy. I didn't even build it right, and we still did really good with it. Oh, man. I'm not even having them. Is there like a cool Bloodcraft build that I can make that I can have fun with? Because this is dumb. I don't like it. Swordcraft. Okay. Prepare for defeat. You must die. I must die. Um. We can send that card back. I don't even really like that card, to be honest. Yeah, let's make our Robo Goblin real big. <laughs> That'd be funny. No summon on one? Okay. No quick bladers, I see. <laughs> oh, you got the big dumb? So do I. <laughs> um... I don't know who to... I guess this one. Huh. That's... that's cool. It's co cool, Liad. Should we make her even bigger? Um... Let's see how blaze... Is armor bad at enhanced 6 or 5? 6. Yeah, let's make that bigger. Actually, let's just go all in on the snake. No Leods, dude. <laughs> I beat the broken. I, I think this is crazy. The ambush build is nuts, I think. Bop. Evolve. You will soon learn. And ride. <laughs> Let's make Bat real big. Bop. Angelic Smite. I guess we see the weaknesses of going all in on one card. No, we're gonna do it again though. <laughs> Let's make Bat real big. <laughs> I guess this is how you have fun with Bloodcraft. You just make some dumb plays. <laughs> Just make your bat huge. It's gonna be at 12. That's nuts. That's insane. Serpent Blade? Okay. That's cold. This guy's an idiot. He didn't realize my armored bat was my main card. Look at that. <laughs> Stupid 12-5, dude. That's so dumb. Is he gonna punish me for this? I've gotten none of the, the crazy cards, and this still happened. This is not okay. Make them bigger. Every means available. You're gonna evolve attack? You are done for. Alright. Emergency mode activated. It's fine with me. Emergency mode activated is right. 
Look at all these boosts. Okay. Hoverboard. It's a Robo Goblin. Okay. Uh. You can do this. Summon the Gear Snake. Evolve her. Reduce the cost of this. Uh, that's it. I mean, I guess he just extended the game, but... I don't know. What the heck is this? Give... Oh, this is just to boost Leod. I was like, what the heck? Sure. Attack Gear Snake? Hoverboard. We have three to five, right? One, two, three, four. We got four. Uh. No card gets us other cards, so. I guess I might as well get rid of this. Enemy Never Let's wrap this up. Get more Machia cards. What's 25 in the deck? Um... I'll just summon Robo Goblin. I don't really... I don't really care for this guy. We're at full health. Yeah, I don't uh, This is not fun. Jellic Smite? Sure. Zazel? Nice. Mechaway? Whoa! Different phrase! Okay. Uh, I guess this. What's gonna burn everything? Radical baby. Sick of my shutting down. Radical baby wouldn't. <laughs> oh, man. The deck that- I didn't even draw the broken and this still went really well. Like, I'm not fearing anything this guy does. <laughs> oh no, that thing can attack twice. This is dumb. I'm just gonna put him out of his misery. <laughs> Whatever he draws, it doesn't matter. Getting rid of the two Leods early on is was stupid. Up oh, there is Leod. Unleash the nightmare. Let's see what we got. Oh man, I really don't like Bloodcraft. I don't like using it. I didn't even think throughout that whole match. I just played cards and they just end up working. <laughs> it's like, okay. Like, my moves are so telegraphed. Like, do this, do this, do this, do this. I got. I don't know. I don't like it. I like being, like, trying to think and, like, strategize and stuff, but. Right, let's see. Maybe, maybe this guy will whoop us, right? Prepare 
before defeat. Bow before Dark Dragoon, ruler of the sky. Um, I like her hand. Keep. Hey, that was a bad move. Keep. Well, let's see. I, let's see. I'm just gonna do like whatever plays. I'm not even gonna think. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna go hoverboard, Robo Goblin. All right. Hoverboard. <laughs> Get the mono, which is broken. Can't believe we could just fetch her that easily. Dragon Oracle? That's a good turn for him. This needs vengeance, right? So. Then the deck more. Get another mono. Alright. Like a Robo Goblin. Psh, nothing on turn four? That's nuts. Uh, just Robo Goblins. And he's got a big turn five play though. Gotta do something. Can't just leave him. Okay. Well, at least we don't gotta use Bloodcraft anymore. Moving on. Ooh, this looks nice though. Nice promo. Yay, no more blood crabs. That was quick. Alright, we got something from... Oh, we got the Angelic Smites. Nice. I forgot we got bonuses from buying trials. Um. Okay, reach level 15. Gotcha, gotcha. Alright, so... Let's delete this, because I'm not going to use that again um so next up is haven which is just as bad i feel um we need these we need the golden bells uh do we need mercenary hoverboards i don't think so we'll just go through and see what we need Oh, I guess so, right? Robo Falcon? Falcon's good. He gives it to Machina? Yeah, so... Yeah, we do. Let's see what Machina cards there are. Uh, for sure, Hoverboards. Robo Goblins are good. Robo Wing is good. None is good. Uh, Father Refinement's good. This card's good, too. Um... Sure, let's just add these. Why not? I don't have Techno Lord. I've never seen a Techno Lord, I think, from a Havencraft player. Um, oh man, these look so cool. I remember some people used these. Swallow so didn't attack, destroy you. I'm gonna tech that. Tech that as a two of. Or one of, actually. Yeah, one of. It's fine. Uh, Kells, for sure. Alana's. I'm not making one, so I'll just use the two we have. And then. De La Phil. We might not be as broken just because I don't have these cards. Purging Light. Wait, Banish a random follower with. Okay. Pretty nuts. Actor. Um. Garuda. Um. What's the term on repair mode? Just restore. What else restores health? Whenever this one attacks, okay. I mean, that's not bad. Oh, Zoe, Zoe's good. Uh, that's it, right? 
think so. Uh, what evolves for free? And I guess we could just put a Warring Thunder. Why not? I was going to put Zeus, but I'm like, eh, forget it. I just want to get the Haven stuff done with. We might not be as broken, though. Hold on, I got a cough. Oof. That was a big cough. Anyway. <laughs> um, is there anything in here? Like, are, can we become more broken? Ammonian, um, Actor, it gives us actors. That's about it. I think this one too, right? It's the free evolve? Yeah. It's the free evolve. Um, we get the bunnies. I remember Steven used this against me, the bunnies. I don't know, I remember what they do though. Put two random followers that cost one play points or less from your deck. Okay. Um, I don't what is this? Banish an enemy follower. Okay. I think we're good though. Um, I don't think we need it. <laughs> as long as we draw Alana, it's fine. So. Once we get the Alanas, I mean, even just getting Kel. Kel's really good. He can wipe boards, even without the prayer. I think we're fine. I just want to not play Haven. <laughs> I had fun with uh, Rune. That was fun. Is but this is not. Despair, We're up against another Haven, My though. You might be broken. Uh, send back Techno. Send back Robo Falcon. <laughs> Get another Robo Falcon. Okay. We got plays, though. We can make our nun bigger with the Falcon. Hey, he got the golden bell. Can we get the golden bell? That'd be cool. No, we can't. Um, hoverboard. I'll meet your robo banner. <laughs> hoverboard gets hoverboard. Every time. Yes. Deal me damage. Uh, let's see. Change the cost of all repair modes in your hand to zero. That is insane. Um. Sack both your Robo Goblins to get rid of my nuns. That'd be cool. If not, we're gonna go hoverboard into Robo Falcon. That'd be that'd be a pretty cool play. Oh man, Robo Falcon! He beat me to it. My hands are tied. Ugh. Fifth the landing. Ooh, heal everything. Okay. Actor. Okay. So let's go. Hoverboard. Into Falcon. Get rid of this. Get rid of this Robo Goblin because it's pretty big. Okay. Um. What's our next play though? I got a weird hand. Cal. Where's our Cal? Wait, what? 
Oh, he doesn't want to use his evolve? I guess. Okay. Hey, there's Golden Bell. Hobo Falcon! That's gonna leave a lump. I mean, I could evolve and get rid of both. Yeah, why not? The real battle begins. I'm surprised you just didn't evolve the Kel. So now next time we can evolve this for free, and then we can Ector, right? Oh, we don't have that enough uh, shadows. <laughs> Surprise why he's not evolving. Okay. Zo, that was good. Evolve for free. Let us conclude. The congregation, they call for me. Gonna leave a lump. I'm just gonna get rid of this, cause. What is this? Oh, uh, subtract the of uh, one haven craft. Oh. Uh, why don't we do the ecther? Lower the Ector's cost. Summoning divine punishment. Interesting. Because Ector is a big play, so lowering his cost would be really good. Uh, then we can go further refinements. Summoning divine punishment. <laughs> How do we get one? Whenever an allied mocking Apollo destroyed, put one in. Okay. If he had so many free evolves, why didn't he just crash? That's fine. This is a weird game. This is a very weird game. Um. Oh, there we, there's the Alana. I don't want to just summon the Father Refinement and just. Actually, you could do a cool play. We could do Alana. Evolve. You are done for. Get the prayer. Peace in the hearts of all. I'll do what I can. Fist the landing. Use it on the Zoe. Summon divine punishment. Summon Zoe. Use our repair mode on ourselves. Head toward hope. There we go. We need... Alright, next turn, we get Father Refinement. He's gonna give us two repair modes that we can use instantly. Just having the prayer, though, is pretty good. Uh, and we do have the Ten Shadows now. So, we can summon the, the Holy Actor. De La Phil. De La Phil's good too. Just no prayer is pretty bad for him though. And he hasn't- he didn't manually evolve anything. Which I'm surprised. You should manually evolve- yeah, the De La Phil. Um, I can actually go Techno Lord. I don't see why not. Just get rid of his field. Dayla feels pretty good too. Um. I go Father Refinement. All right, let's go Robo Wing. Techno Lord. How could you? Heal ourselves. Head toward hope. One step at a time. 
And then get some mecha wings in there. Impressive technology. Now we got a bean and we got pretty good field. If he lets anything live, we're gonna start making stuff real big. Uh I'm probably gonna go with uh a Dela fill. Okay, none. I'm surprised he still hasn't gotten the Alana. Oh, you have new bunnies? Cool. The new Haven legendary made it more viable? I don't remember, but when I saw it, it didn't seem too good. But I might just not be seeing what you saw. Uh, let me see. Let me go back to it. I still have it up. To uh, so the bunnies use amulets. That's interesting. Pair mode. Okay. I'm sorry, my friends. Uh. Heal up. Head toward hope. There's another Alana. Uh, Enemy identified. I feel like we should just get rid of his stuff, right? Can he? No. Enemy identified. Enemy identified. One step at a time. It's a shame. <sighs> I should have gotten rid of these to just put a Dela Fill out there and stuff. Oh well. Oh, he got rid of our prayer. Oh yeah, here's where I shine. None can pierce my shield. My ultimate take care of can't figure it out. That's pretty bad. I gotta say, that's pretty bad. Summoning divine punishment. Uh, the Holy Cavaliers will be uh be pretty big, so um, that's fine. I'm not really worried. You can go acting. Summon the actor. You're just techno lord. Oh, you know we should we should summon this first. Oops. Oh well. Techno lord is coming in clutch. Heavenly Aegis? Oh, right. This card might be trouble. Take them by the neck. <laughs> Father Refinement's pretty cool right here. Yeah, that, that's pretty good. Oh, yeah. Here's where I shot. Cal? Alright. Unicorn! Oh. Ouch. Get rid of our father to refinement. this burn a card no warring thunder 
Flying Thunder would have been awesome, actually. Um, we can lower our Daylight Fill. Wait, is Ector a Machina? No. Okay. Uh. Oh, we got our own Heavenly Ages. Neat. Um, why don't we do... De La Phil. I can get him up to five. To get rid of this. And that's pretty good. The next time we can just summon Heavenly Ages, so. As long as we can stall out his Heavenly Ages a bit, I think we'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Unicorn gets rid of this. Oh. Oh, restore four instead. Got it. Golden Bell's good. Uh, right here. Hmm. Can get rid of... This? Heavenly Ages. Uh, Alana. I can heal up four, so. Zo, okay. It's gonna start drawing. E. That hurts. Got we gotta get rid of the unicorn. Lana, uh, this gives another, Lana's not Machina, so, do this, oh man, this is rough, this is rough. Him having the Aegis first hurts. Hopefully can't get rid of our... Alana as quick. Damn, he can. That's game. Oh no, that's 11. That's 11 right there. But we also can't, like, kill. Hmm. Yikes. Stop. Yeah, the cow's a little late. Oh, yeah, here's where I shine. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't matter. 13, 14. Oh well. Uh, 
That sucks. <laughs> So our lo the first loss in a while, and this is a long game too. I'm surprised he didn't get the Alana. Uh, even craft's not that fun to play either. Oh man, I can't wait to finish these, so that way we can go back to having some more fun with the other ducks. More Haven, cool. Is fighting and despair all you know? May eternal peace be yours. All right, so we drew the Alana. Nice. Uh, we can send back the Warring Thunder. Golden Bell, sweet. All right, so, Ankel, nice. We just won't have plays for next turn. Which is a little unfortunate, but... The hand's not looking that bad. Ooh, nothing on one, so no golden bell. Um, I'm kind of going to save the Tender Rabbit. I don't mind not playing cards later, uh, early. Robo wing, that's pretty good. <laughs> we got our attack. Um, it's fine. I'll take the two damage. We could just summon this guy, and then it'll destroy everything. Oh, it won't destroy that though. Yikes. Um, get rid of the Robo Wing. Robo Wing is pretty annoying. So next turn we got a cool Alana play. So Alana evolve into Tender. Can even Kel if really needed. If he goes off. He's got to destroy this, right? I am your salvation. You are done for. Okay. The congregation, they call for me. Oh. <laughs> I got we laughs. Techno Lord, we got zero Machinas destroyed. You are done for. Let our Alana live. I'll do what I can. Oh, we can't even destroy this. Okay. My hands are tied. Next time we could just kill. Salvation. Okay. He's got his own Alana, which is nuts. I don't even know if, depending on how many times he heals, he heals, well he can heal two times actually. I'm not sure how useful Cal will be. Okay, we'll be able to get rid of the Alana. It's a big yikes though. We're at nine. Get rid of the Alana. Actually, we can get rid of everything. It's not bad. <laughs> 
don't know why he's been attacking face, though. That seems a little bit weird. Really, not the prayer. Okay. Mecha wings? Technology. I mean, Kel is a pretty big threat. I can see where he's going. I mean, Kel is huge, so. Summoning divine punishment. Let us conclude. Emergency mode activated. Making you worry like that? Damn, we both went through both of our evolves. Uh, all our evolves, actually. That's insane. Alright, hoverboard. It's a warring thunder. I am the thunder of war incarnate. None is good. Light em up. Shutting down. We can go uh none into Dela. No, we can go Dela Phil. We can't go into both. If needed, we could go none into Robo Falcon. Our Techno Lord's actually at zero still, surprisingly. How many of those has he played? For me. Oh, he's only played three, so he needs... He should get it, right? Oh, man. Ooh, that's a big play for him. That's a really big play. Um... We gotta get rid of Dela, Phil. Give this a rush. Attack. Uh, I can beef him up by one, but that's it. I'll just leave my my hoverboard. Next time we can Dela fill in repair mode. This is the rough part that we're starting to fall behind. Um, he can get rid of my De La Phil. Well, I cannot get rid of this. Which is unfortunate. Hmm. I mean, they are getting pretty big, so... Pother Refinement next turn would be pretty cool. <laughs> Having three Technolords, though, that are at two, kind of stinks. I'm surprised you haven't drawn a lot of our Machina cards. Yep, get rid of the Mercenary. He's getting big. He should be getting the Aegis soon. He's already played four. Oh, you have played four others. Okay, so you can play it now and get it. There it is. That's rough. Uh... Hmm. I definitely need to get rid of this. That's a for sure. It sucks that I have to get rid of my Falcon, though. The technology is remarkable. 
unlockable. I'm always in search of new technology. Buying access. Ah, oh, man. The Aegis has been my biggest downfall. Both games. Okay. Cal. That technology is remarkable. Oh man. You've been screwed over by uh, Angelic Smite actually both games. Well, now our Techno Lord's pretty big at 7. Um, but we just lose anyway. And we just don't hit the Aegis. Nope. <laughs> it don't matter. <laughs> we just lose. Why? I'll be back. Heal once? Kill me? Be taken. Why does he not want to kill me? Just let me move on to the next- oh, there we go. Cool. <laughs> Thank you, let me move on. I just want to get rid, rid of these. Challenges. Okay. Do 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 do. Ah. Steven, these are, are not fun games. Why do people like to use these? Another Havencraft? Oh my gosh. May eternal peace be yours. Okay. Um send back everything. I can I think I could, I should get rid of the Techno Wards. They're not doing too hot. Sealed tome. Oh, something not this. Holy Falcon. Okay. That's cool. Or maybe it was just attack to draw cards? Maybe it was. Techno Lord. Oh boy. At least we can beef up the Techno Lord this time. We actually have Machina cards to play. Robo Falcon. Sealed Tome. Uh, we go Mecha Wing. Technology. Next turn we can actually kill. Oh yeah, let's get rid of that thing. Shutting down. Shutting down. Talking about like three. Oh, let's just kill. Nope, I'm not having any ages shenanigans. <laughs> you can get rid of the cow, that's fine. Cal already did his job. He got rid of three cards. Lana. Can you heal once? Did he Oh yeah, he got a repair mode from the um Robo Goblin. He didn't use it though. What? 
Okay. I'm confused. Wouldn't you want to keep your Alana? Oh, I'm a big dummy. We should play the Robo Wing first. Alright, that was a misplay. Uh, we can go Zone next turn. Oh, actually, we should get the Daylight Field going, right? Oh, I guess it didn't matter. Kel would have gotten rid of both of them anyway. But it, it is it's still a misplay, so. Wait, what? Am I the big idiot? What what just happened? The real battle begins. Why is he not evolving? What is going on? Did he just like big brain AJ me? No, wait. You don't have nine shadows, my guy. I think he might be also doing the challenge. And he doesn't. Yeah. I think he just didn't know what was going on. I pray that you will be freed from suffering. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's one down. Two more wins. Accelerate him. Is fighting and despair all you know? You must die. You must die. Please. I don't want to play Havencraft. I don't like it. I don't like Haven. Maybe our next two opponents will just give up and then that's it. <laughs> How does Ambush deal with Haven? That just popped into my mind, like... They both get real big. Oh, meet the Eleven Sisters? Nice. So, we're gonna go hoverboard into. Mina. I wish I was playing Swordcraft right now. Oh, none. Nice. We can go into none. Maybe we should summon Robo Goblin so that he would crash the Mina into the. Oh, okay. Didn't do that anyway, so. Uh, we can go none. Because now he has to Serpent Blade. That would be a great card for him right now. And then he can attack me 2 2 and then get a loot card and get rid of my mercenary. That'd be a great play for him. Ah, uh, I don't know about that. I really don't know about. Oh, well, actually, now he can attack my nun. He could kind of do the same play, but he's getting rid of his mind now. But still, that's a weird play. It was too luck reliant, I think. Why didn't he... Why is he attacking face? I'm just gonna kill. Kel gets rid of both. And I get healed, so... Uh, next turn we can Alana into a repair mode. Fear and despair are no match for me. Leisha, nice. Quick later, nice. Good play for him. Yep. Gets rid of my field, but I got rid of his Leisha. 
Uh, I do want to get rid of this. So... You can go... Robo Goblin? Into Robo Falcon? Just get rid of that. And now we can go Alana and boost up a bit more. He's wasted a lot of cards. I still don't know about that Ivory Sword play. This is a weird play. Another Leisha? Okay. Lathan. Okay. That wasn't bad. Uh... Alana? Evolve? We gotta get the prayer up there. Tender Rabbit? And then attack, golden bell. Next time we can Zo, because he's got to use this on the the Alana, or he could evolve and keep it. But I don't see why. Yeah. He's running out of steam. Damn, using an evolve to attack my. My bunny. Oh, Ivory Sword. That's a good play. Deal six. He's running out of steam, though. We can just last. Get rid of his field, which we can. Oh, we for sure can. Uh, let's go, Zo. Uh, heal. Heal. Maybe we should have just summoned one of these, right? Oh well. We can summon him now. I wanted to see if we got something else. But maybe we should have summoned. It would have been a 5-5. Five, five. Yeah, that would have been a better play. He would have been a 5-5. Five, five. Oak trees. We've all for free. Nice. It won't be long now. Mortal or deity, I'll have them all. Crash into the zoo. Um, what's been our highest cost destroyed? Machina. The nun. Yeah, if he would have been a 5 5. Damn, dude. That would have been crazy. Pair mode? Ooh. Father Refinement. Um. Let's go Warring Thunder. Bop. Damn. Yeah, that was a big misplay that I didn't play, but we're, we're gonna draw two more cards. So, I think we, we got a. I think we pretty much got this. We got defensive cards, we're gonna draw two more cards. Yeah. Postal? Okay. He can get, possibly get rid of my field. Depending. That's pretty good. We were one short. Okay. You gotta attack. There you go. Okay. That's not bad. We used a lot of cards, though. 
Holden Bell. Uh, I mean, I could. I don't know if I should. Um... That gives me a repair mode. I do want to get rid of this. I could get rid of it. Bop. Pair mode? Bell? Attack. Do this. Oh, can I still do? Oh, I can still play stuff, but I'm not going to. Um, okay. So, our Techno Lord, if he gets rid of our field, our Techno Lord's gonna be at 9. Probably a Latham right there. Meet the Lemon Sisters! That's a great card for him right now. Alright, we are also running out of steam now. Alright, the... The Mina will be able to attack, and I think... Oh, Archer! Okay. Evolve the Archer, get rid of one, and then attack. Crash? I'm assuming. Yeah. Makes sense. We're at eight, so I can actually get rid of the whole field. Ooh, Daylaw Phil. Actually, really good. I want to find the refinement though, and then do that. Repair mode. Make them bigger. <laughs> Next time we can Daylaw Phil. Still got a Techno Lord. Eight. Even if he summons Latham, won't be as good. Cause he'll have, he'll gain the effect, but since he doesn't have an evolve, then it's fine. That's mine. It's fine too. Taylor Phil. Uh, we can't summon Robo Falcon. We can actually get rid of his field. Again. Oh man, this was not fun for him. I mean, it wasn't fun for us either. I don't like winning like this it's so bad. The only thing that beat us was Havencraft that actually are full Havencraft. Attack the De La Phil. I mean, Father Refinement's really annoying too. Yeah. That was unfortunate. I pray that you will be freed from suffering. All right, last one. Hopefully, last one. <laughs> Release me. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's see what we face. As long as we don't face Havencraft, I think we're fine. It's nuts. Shadow? Okay. Is fighting in despair all you I'm going first. Mother, father, come on. I feel like going first in this deck is... Is eh? I prefer to go second.
<laughs> Maybe I just like going second in general, just because I get the extra evolve. But I mean, going first isn't bad either, to be honest. Alana, we can summon at five and then still heal, so. Like, summon at five, evolve. Because we have to do that anyway, right? So. Maybe it doesn't matter. Uh, ooh, Golden Bell. Nice. Got the Golden Bell going on. Uh, next turn we can... We can Mecha Wing. Well, actually, we could save the Mecha Wing, make our 1-1s one -ones bigger. I don't know how we'll do against Shadow, though. I don't know what... If they're, what if he's playing the, the deck we said? The Kakaitis build? That'd be pretty cool. Alana! Um... Uh, um uh... We could do this. You could just attack face, too. Attack face. Not summon anything. You'd probably keep it then. Um. Then you can evolve. Attack with the evolve and not. Yeah. Let's just get rid of it. <laughs> not play anything on four. I kind of want to try out double prayer. Maybe double prayer would be as good. Because we have one less evolve. Okay. We can deal with that. Beep boop pop. Make her a 6-3. Um, I'm thinking, depending on what he does, I'm thinking we could do Mecha Wing into a repair mode. And if he gets a big field, we can go into Cal. I'm coming. Oh, there it is. Destroy the Alana. We are drawing two cards too, so that's not me. The one poke. More draw. Oh, we should have summoned this first. I keep forgetting. You could tell I'm not used to the prayer. He's probably confused, like, why didn't he do that first? Because then our Warring Thunder could have been 5-5. Five, five. Oh well. I wonder if it'll matter. I mean, still one, one attack is still pretty good. Why not get the buff if you can, right? Do, 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 do. <laughs> My confused tactic. The big what did he do? Uh Hector is still not active, but Oh okay. Why did he make a play? The one attack is gonna make a big difference. Yikes. Could have gotten rid of that. Okay. I mean, we can still get rid of it. It's a cowl away from getting rid of 
Or... No. Kel. Yeah, yeah. Mecha Wing? Evolve? The real battle begins. My ultimate technique. Shoot Bop. Maybe we shouldn't just be wasting our repair modes though. For you. Because if he does get a big field, we don't have an answer for this. Oh, we actually have Ector, so it's not too bad. Ector, and then... That's it, right? Ooh. What is that? I keep seeing this card, but I don't know what it does. Ambush, whenever this follower attacks, if Ambush is active... Destroy all... Oh, that's pretty good. Pretty good. Alright, what's the big play? What's Tekken Lord at? Two? So if he gets rid of our field, he'll be at four. Which won't be... Too good, but you gotta get rid of the field, though. Currently, yeah, okay. Okay. Evolve him. Got it. What? Uh. Okay. Enemy identified. Enemy identified. Do this. Blood. Okay. Let the gems light your way to success. That was weird. Why didn't he attack? Darker in the dark. Oh my gosh, ten ten. He just burns stuff. Uh, let's go, Ector. Go rabbit. Attack. Uh could attack. What's our technical word out? Four. See Steven told me not to do that. Not to have trade, so I'll listen to Steve. As soon as this attacks, it's gonna get rid of everything, right? Except Ector. So I guess that's a good play. They didn't attack. Okay. That's a big card, though. Jeez. Look at that. 10 10. Um. She's either Infernal Crown or. Descent into Madness. Okay. She says hello. Deal one, deal one damage. Okay. Infernal Crown at the end of your turn. Three random eight. eight. 
Mm-hmm. This card's pretty good, too. Yep. Attack the actor? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go Cal. None. Uh, get rid of trying to heal here. This. There we go. Bop. All right, it's almost over. I think that was his big play, so. Kel's so good. It's insane. I think Kel is what makes Haven, to be honest. His prayer's good, but it's just, I don't know, like, I feel that Kel, for sure, is the headliner. I'm surprised he's a gold. Okay. Uh, let's go... Let's go none. Pair mode. What's the clash ability? If the enemy has storm or rush, give it minus two. Okay. Uh, I could, just to make a go by quicker. Because then he has to kill everything. Sure, sure. Let's just do it. Alright, if he leaves anything alive, we won. Just on board is freaking insane. What do we got? 9, 15, 23. <laughs> Even if you would heal back to full somehow, we still had game. That's insane. Maybe I'll disconnect. <laughs> That's his big tactic. Okay, cool. We win. We got all the promos. Oh, this one actually looks really nice. I like that they're animated too. I pray that you will be freed from suffering. Match bonus? Yeah. Oh no no no, we're not we're not playing yet. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Uh, that's it for the stream. I'm just going to collect our two awards. Ba, ba, ba. Hey. Wait, what? Clear chapter 11? We got... Oh, we got legendary books? Neat. Okay. We should probably do that sometime. <laughs> um... But yeah, uh, that's going to be it for this stream, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Uh, I didn't have, as, as you guys noticed, my hype kind of started dwindling as uh, the games went on. Because Bloodcraft was a well, big more like Snorfest for me. And then so was Haven. I was like, uh. But I had a ton of fun with Rune. I gotta say, Rune was nuts. It was really fun. But uh, anyway, guys... That's going to be it. This is going to be JC Klein just signing out. I'll see you on the next one. And probably, I'm not going to say when because, as you notice, I haven't been streaming a lot lately. 
Uh, I've been busy with uh, not only work, but also I'm doing some cool stuff for the channel. I'm gonna probably start Twitch uh, streaming on Twitch too. I'm um, looking into that and learning stuff about Twitch and stuff. But anyway, guys, that's gonna be it. I'm gonna probably put a video up when we do go to Twitch and all those little surprises are gonna be ready to go live. So look out for that. Uh, so yeah, guys, Jason Collins, sign out. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.